The shrine is on the far side of the room. Quickly, we must find our way across. I have a surprise for you, Sai. Do you remember your fallen comrades from the Dragon Guard? I've taken the liberty of raising them, and they're quite anxious to see you. You certainly did a thorough job hiding the amulet, Sai. Couldn't you have just stuffed it in a mattress or something? The second shrine is in the chamber beyond. There is a trick to reaching it. A puzzle of sorts. The altar is on the far side, but to reach it, the drawbridge must be lowered. Corridors, crumbling walls, nauseating smells. This place has all the charm of a rift and brothel. It must feel very much like home to you, Titan. You mean a crypt filled with the rotting corpses of inbred kings and failed statesmen? Must be what it's like at a Tharn family reunion. Amulet of Kings, I will be transformed. All the nations of Tanriel will bow before me. They will worship me and beg for my mercy. All will know the name of Manimarco as their one true god. You'll never get away with it, Manimarco. We'll fight you to our last breath. By all means, my old friends. 
Try and stop me! How many more doors? There it is. The door to the Vault of Kings. The shrines have been consecrated in Stendar's name. Now you must use the Ring of Stendar's mercy to open the vault doors. Stand in the casting circle and direct the Ring of the Doors to lift the ward. The door should open wide. Amulet. I can see it from here. Can stop the most well powerful done. necromancer Tamriel has ever known. This is merely a transition. My first step towards true immortality. Now witness my true power. Watch as I rise up from the grave and ascend to godhood. Worm! You think you can betray the lord of brutality and domination without consequence? You will pay for your arrogance. You will writhe in agony for the rest of eternity. Your tortured screams will echo throughout oblivion to serve as a warning to others. Everything Manimarko did was designed to protect each other. We can't let that happen. 
what we can accomplish when we work together. It is done. Madam Arca will pay dearly for the rest of eternity. One cannot out-scheme the god of schemes without paying a heavy price. I cannot imagine the torment that awaits him. Sai Sahan must rest, as must we all. We can sleep a little easier knowing the King of Worms has been defeated, but we cannot rest too long. Molog Bal is still a great threat, and the plane melt must be stopped or this will all be for naught. I've not forgotten, Vestage. It's another piece of the puzzle, and we shall address it in due time. But for now, let us rest and recover. As always, I will contact you soon. Walk in the light, Vestage.